Hey guys, how are you? I hope you all are doing good. Welcome back to another video. Today in this video, I'm gonna show you a full review and the installation of Havoc OS 4.9 official build for our Redmi Note 8 and Note 8 T. So sorry for being late. I was busy in some stuff. So uh, without any further ado, let's get started. Basically, I was waiting for the uh, latest build of this ROM, but now we have it right here. As you can see here, its Android version is 11. Havoc OS version is 4.9 and the security patch is also latest September 5, 2021. So without any further ado, let's get started. So the ROM is pretty much awesome. There is no any single lag or issue. Uh, it is just smoothie. Uh, I haven't seen uh, any ROM like this. The smoothness of this ROM is just awesome and here we have a lot of options in the quick settings you can edit and add them and we also have the google now right here to check what's new on google news and we don't have a lot of junky applications right here we only have some uh, necessary applications but if you want uh, to download some applications you can use the play store as well uh, the overall performance of this ROM is just amazing out of this world uh, I can't believe I am having a ROM like this and it's a custom ROM I can't believe it's a custom ROM and its performance is just awesome on our Redmi Note 8 so here we have the MIUI camera pre-installed in this ROM as you can see here and it is working pretty much awesome and you can also install any uh, gcam mode from my website beta modes.info and uh, now let's dig into the settings you can see the smoothness of this rom how animations are played and it, it it's just smooth it's just amazing in the settings first of all we have search uh, your name logo and wi-fi option and then we have Wi-Fi Internet Connected YC Configuration Center. In the Configuration Center, let me increase a little bit of brightness. Maybe you can see it clearly or not. So first of all, we have these settings for custom status bar. From here, you can change the clock style, logo. You can enable or disable this logo right from here. And you can also style the uh, you can also change the logo style and logo position uh, some brightness uh, gestures network settings you can change the battery icons and you can adjust the status bar icons as well then we have quick settings lock screen ambient display and always on display is also present right here and it works pretty much awesome but it will drain your battery quickly because we don't have the AMOLED display then we also have the double tap gestures then we have buttons and navigation bar first of all we have the system navigation in the system navigation we have the uh, three button navigation two button navigation from here you can also adjust the uh, gesture navigation settings like you can hide the navigation bar pill and you can uh, just adjust the sensitivities of the edges then we have some volume button uh, settings then we have gestures in the gesture quickly open camera system navigation bar prevent ringing power manual from uh, you can from here you can also enable the advanced reboot so then we have quick touch skip music tracks swipe three fingers to screenshot then we have notification settings uh, battery saving option screen option media option and uh, in the misc we also have the gaming mode which is the advanced gaming mode and then we have about section after it we have the apps and notifications battery the battery performance of this rom is just amazing even on this talk uh, kernel uh, from here we you can use the battery saver and you can enable or disable the charging led you can also enable the adaptive charging then we have display in the display we have brightness and brightness level dark theme which is working awesome as you can see it looks pretty much good on this display uh, then we have a uh, night light which is working fine adaptive brightness styles and wallpapers in the styles we only have one style pre-installed but uh, don't worry you can create your own by clicking on the custom button then you can change the wallpapers from here you can choose any wallpaper 
and then we have cloaks you can choose cloak style for your look screen let me apply this one and as you can see here it pretty much uh, pretty much uh, matches with the wallpaper and it looks pretty much awesome then we have live display screen timeout and the rotation colors you can change the font size display size and you can enable or disable the double tap to wake then we have sound the sound quality of this rom is just amazing and you can see it, it, it is just working fine then we have uh, vibration and haptics and here we have all advanced sounding options available right here so after it we have storage privacy location security and in this security all security options are available like screen locks are also working uh, fingerprint is also working and face unlock and we also have the app locker right here no need to install any third party application to lock your applications then we have accounts accessibility google digital well-being system in the system we have languages and input date and time backup rules reset options multiple users system updates and xiaomi parts in the xiaomi part we have the me sound enhancer which will be helpful to enhance the sounding quality of this room and from here you can also change some display settings and you can also use the display color collaboration and you can also enable the usb charging then in the smart uh, about phone we have the about phone section as you can see here the android version of this havoc os is 11 havoc os version is 4.9 official build so the rom is pretty stable there is no any single bug or issue in this rom everything is just working fine and of course you can use it as your daily driver and if you want to install this rom or uh, want to try this rom then just download the rom from the link in the description and reboot your device into an installed custom recovery so if you like custom rom videos and uh, uh, you are a custom rom boy like me then you should must subscribe my channel and uh, it's not rebooting in the recovery so we have to keep and press the volume button plus uh, volume up button plus power button to boot into the recovery mode and right now i am using the team in recovery if you have not installed it yet then you can watch my previous video just unlock it go to wipe advanced wipe and from here you have to wipe everything except the internal storage and sd card do not select internal storage and sd card just just wipe selected items go back to home click on install and now look at your downloaded have os 4.9 official build just click on it and install it right from here after installing it you can also install the magix manager if you want to root your rom after installing zip files click on reboot and click on system and in a few seconds the rom will be installed on your redmi note 8 and note 8t so hope you guys like this video if you really did hit the like button don't forget to subscribe my channel keep supporting thanks for watching peace yaar dekh lo kitna pasina aa raha hai pasina bahana padta hai videos banane ke liye please subscribe kar do